Hello everyone, today we are going to introduce a Micro Rus robot. Many people may not know what is Micro Rus. Micro Rus is a lightweight version of Rust 2 officially designed for microcontroller environments. Supports efficient running of Rust 2 applications on resource-constrained hardware platforms. It is a cost-effective solution for learning Rust 2. This robot car can implement Rust 2 applications through Micro Rus by ESP32 microcontroller. For example, slam mapping navigation and multi-robot collaborative actions, etc. You can learn Rust 2 development without ARM controllers such as Jetson slash Raspberry Pi, and it is also equipped with a TOF high-performance LiDAR. Very cost-effective. Now let us open its box. And we can see that the robot car has been assembled. We only need to install the battery and it can be used. The outside of the robot is a solid and durable aluminum alloy frame with a unique structural design that is beautiful and durable. At the top is a LiDAR. Using TOF ranging method, the measurement radius can reach 12M. Measurement blind zone, 3 cm. Sampling frequency, 4500 times slash S. Scanning frequency, 7 Hz 15 Hz. Resistant to 30 clux outdoor strong light. Supports indoor and outdoor mapping navigation. The bottom of the car is equipped with four PCS metal reduction motors with encoder and built-in hall encoders, which can achieve high-precision feedback control of speed and position. The metal material is wear-resistant and durable, and providing precise and stable motion control. Contains a micro Rust expansion board inside. This is a Rust 2 driver controller and an ESP32 dual-core development board. The control board integrates the ESP32 S3 core module control unit, motor drive, servo drive, 6-axis IMU attitude sensor and other important peripherals, support Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, serial port and other communication functions, supports 4-channel motors with encoder, 2-channel PWM servos, 1-channel LiDAR and 1-channel PD power supply for Raspberry Pi 5. The robot car comes with peripheral driver firmware when it leaves the factory, and users can directly connect it to the Rust 2 environment for use. Next, we install the battery into the car for testing. Before operating a micro Rus robot, you need to prepare a Windows computer with a virtual machine. The computing tasks of the robot have been transferred to the virtual machine environment on the PC for execution. All data of the car are transmitted wirelessly and transparently to the virtual machine system by the ESP32 processor through Micro Rus, enabling efficient monitoring and control of the robot's status. Next, we will show the app mapping navigation. Yaboom Tutorials consists of two parts. Part 1 is practical training course, from quick use of robots, to robot control, laser radar, and multi-robot collaboration. You can learn robot control from easy to difficult. Part 2 is theoretical course, from basic Linux system operations to Docker development environment configuration. You can systematically learn Rust 2 architecture, communication mechanism and node programming. It also includes the application development of Micro Rust on the embedded platform and the basic routines of ESP32. Compared with traditional Rust cars, Micro Rust robot cars use virtual machines to replace ARM masters such as Raspberry Pi. It reduces learning costs and effectively utilizes the powerful computing performance of PC. The operation smoothness and running effect are significantly better than ordinary embedded devices. Micro Rust Robot provides an ideal solution for developers looking for a low-cost entry into Rust 2. Yaboom tutorials not only include depth learning Rust 2, but also cover comprehensive and detailed hardware driver tutorials.